Minneapolis kids are now back in school. We were at Lucy Craft Laney Community School yesterday. Students got some high fives as they got ready to get their new school year started. I love that high five to start oh, off the new year. And the handshake. I yeah. mean, gosh, that gets was you in the way. mood, doesn't it? it uh, we totally. Have our, our lifestyle contributor, Jasmine, Jasmine Stringer, here with us today. And there are some trends. As they always are when you come out to the new school year, and you are going to tell us about them. Yeah, you know, basically, I have been telling everybody when it comes to getting your kids ready for school, think three simple words plan, prepare, and organize. Okay. So, you know, you're going to plan. Right. Uh, we talked about school supplies earlier today. So, you know that every school district has their you school the supply list. list yeah. on. Mm -hmm. So, you're going to take a day, you're going to go get the school supplies. Maybe you're ordering them online, and then you're going to prepare by organizing them. So, one of the things that I find keeps not only me organized in my professional and personal life, but I know my friends with kids that keep sure. them organizing is labeling. Yeah. And oh, I yeah. love a labeler, a personal labeler. Like, I have this brother, P200. They're so easy, easy and convenient, and now you can even change like the ribbon change and make them out. But sure. look, I made little folders for your oh, kids, great. so they'd be oh, personal. So then, nice. so then it's organized. So not only have you done the planning and prepared, but you have them organized because you now have nice. their names. You can make it. a fun and afternoon out of label making. Exactly. My nerdy side coming That's out. Right. Exactly. <laughs> exactly. Get that label maker out. Good. So then you know you think about meals, and everybody talks about meal prep, and you mm -hmm. talk about meal prep for dinner but meal prep can also be for your breakfast it can also be for your mm. kids snacks because you think okay what are you gonna have for breakfast are you gonna do cereal are you going to do um, fruit or carrots in the afternoon mm. you can pre portion all of that and I actually do this so these are all my because I'm trying to be healthy that, these yeah. are all my <laughs> snacks I put them in this nice ziplock easy container and then I put them in ziplock bags so I know oh, that you, snacks that you can have some too you're welcome to have some, yeah. 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 some of my snacks but yeah and so again with with Ziploc bags, easy open. I've got my grapes, I've got my carrots, I've it's got one washed, for every it's day. Ready. It's all ready. It too. And it is labeled Jasmine snacks. Yeah. I right. Love it. Or, and I found this, I, I was at Target and I found this container and I was like, oh my God, this is super cute. So it is. Um, Pre-scored, so think if you have, you could do a sandwich or if you're sure. doing a meal, so you have like Just soccer night snacks, dinner, right? So it's right. soccer dinner, okay. easy to go, put it Boom. in the microwave, so there Good you set. plan and organize. Perfect. And then finally, a calendar. Now we all have our calendars on our phones, on our computers at work, but every family needs a family command calendar, one that everybody can see and they can access and write things. Even the kids can say, mom, can you help organize a play date or something like that? Again, preparing, planning and keeping your family organized will keep them ready and prepared for the start of school. Then they're set. They're then set. they're happy. Yeah. The Are you guys ready? Have you prepared? Or are you uh, planning? I hope so. Well, I don't know. You're already getting started. You have <laughs> I have no vacation. I have no you idea. Have Welcome back, Stacey. Welcome to work. No, you know, we, we definitely, the calendar is key. The calendar. Especially when you have two kids going in different directions. Right. Who's going to drive here? Who's going to do this? Just keeping everything straight. And then your kids are older, so I think it is nice for them to be able it's to physically idea. see the calendar. Let them do it. Yeah. All right. I'll move over to the Google Docs. That's true. There we'll just get them on the calendar. <laughs> We're very there high tech. Very, oh, you guys Thanks, are high Thanks, Jasmine. Thank we have more of Jasmine's lifestyle tips and her thoughts on seizing the day on her blog, Carpe Diem, with Jasmine. Just go to WCCO.com slash links, and we'll get you there. Thanks, Jasmine. Thank you.